Collect three power cards. My dog can beat them. Hey, cool! Power cards! Bet if I collect enough of them, I can pick up new abilities. He smells funny. I love this treadmill! I'm on V. Okay, good sweat. We can stop any time. One minute on this, and I'll work up a good sweat. Once I ran on here for two hours. But uh, let's not do that again. What are we practicing for? A marathon? The rest of the zoo is great. Maybe we should check it out. How about visiting the snack bar? I could use a cold drink. How about we press the stop button? This is animal abuse. I think Alex is waiting on me. Hey, Alex! Help! I can't get off this thing! I'm glad that kid's watching. Maybe it'll inspire him to exercise. Don't leave me here! Sure, just go off and do your own thing. Leave old Marty here to rot. My thumbs are killing me. I give you a buck to stop it. What's wrong with you? Go get the money. your birthday, okay? You don't have to butter me up. I was being sincere, man. It's good to see you. Okay, you caught me. I got you something, but what with all my rehearsing, I haven't had time to wrap it yet. Four shows a day. Gotta get into character four times. That'll take its toll, sure. Yeah, four a day. And with all due respect for what you do and your whole treadmill shtick, it's not the easiest thing in the world remaking myself from scratch after each performance. But seriously, man, you've hit the big 1-0. Only comes once. So, you want me to run you through your routine? Actually, a living audience does kind of help me focus my chi. Uh, just stand still right there. Perfect, Marty. Perfectly stationary. Thanks. Press the jump button to... I think by now we're up to speed on jumping there, Evil Knievel. Okay, then. Get jumping. Find your three power cards so we can move on. Seeing your smiling faces makes it all worthwhile. It's so nice to interact with the fans. Find your three power cards. Now you should be 
able to get some extra air. At the top of your jump, just press that freaky jump button again to somersault to higher place. Now let's see you jump through the rainbow ring. The people dig it. Well, looky here, it's that overly pampered lion. Let's show him who the real kings of New York are. Someone want a ranch dressing? <laughs> you can't do your act with those pigeons raining on your parade. Use your attack button to roar and scare them off. Pedestal and do the regal pose bit. You're still a king. Don't let those flying rats tell you different. Looks like my work here is done. Maybe you ought to swing by Glorious. You look like you need a little pick-me-up. Nobody cheers up a zebra like a hippo, right? I'll see you tonight at the birthday thing. Now, if you'll excuse me. Security. Maybe Melman can cheer me up. No matter how bad I think things are, they're always somehow worse for him. Marty, what's wrong? Is it contagious? What's wrong? Well, I've just been feeling a little... Oh, things are going okay with me. Except, of course, for the germs. Oh, and then there's the microbes. And then there's the fact that I've been waiting for my medication for the last 38 minutes. Oh, Marty, this is the end. How can you stand it? Okay. I'll see you later, Melvin. Feels good! Boy, that Melman sure could use some professional help. It's one of those arcade games. Me I love this game!
stupid game? Happy birthday, Marty. Thanks, Glow. Look, sister, are we gonna race or just get in touch with our inner angst storm day? They wanna race you? I uh, know. Do they know about the... Nope. So they're full of... To the beaks. You heard the zebra. Time to put your money where your mouth is. In point of fact, we have neither money nor mouths. But if you're really up for a race, we accept your challenge. Marty, would you mediate? On your mark, get set. Did I say move yet? I don't think so. In fact, forget it. The race is canceled. No! It may not be very late, but I can use my tumble attack by pressing the attack button. I can't stop! Wow, those spicy peppers are get you moving. It is we that will be victorious. some of those hay bales and find a shortcut. You are beaten, hippopotamus. By mercy. It wasn't even close. Okay, maybe it was a little close, but the point is, you still beat those bird brain brains in. Awesome, Glow. Looks like my work here is done. Guess I'll kick it on back to the curb. Aw, oh, Marty. Don't be blue-striped. Chin up. It is your birthday, after all. We will dominate every aspect of this challenge. That's classified. Classified? To whom? Looks more like you're just hanging around by a hole in the wall. Absolutely not. We're in the midst of a covert training operation, trying to bring the private here up to speed in the ancient military art of fishing. Now that I think about it, the operation really isn't so covert. Would you care to observe? Sure. Beats anything else I got going. All right, private. It's time to prove yourself in the field. Move your pole left and right. Once you're ready to drop that lure, hold down the action button, and when you want to reel the fish in, just release the action button. Look up and down to control how far you throw the lure. Simple, right? Well, let's see you catch some fish. Not quick enough, son. The fish will grab the bait right off the hook if reflexes aren't tip-top. Technique, son. Now let's see you land that green garam. Do not give up, son. No quitters in my unit. Outstanding! Now go for only red herring. some chops as a fisherman, son. But war sometimes requires creativity. Snare a stuffed lion decoy. May come in handy later.
Steadfast, soldier. Steadfast. <laughs> Ten, hut. Two, three, four. Cover the hat. Keep fishing, so let's see if you can find me some sunglasses. Now get me a bucket, soldier. That was some first class fishing. You've completed your training. Those penguins are cooking something up. Hmm. Wonder if Melman's cooled off enough to talk. That was enough balloons. Let the hilarity ensue right on schedule. Sup, Melman? Hey, Marty. I forgot to wish you a happy birthday earlier. Sometimes I get wrapped up in my own problems. My basic hygienic needs are going unmet. Say what? I don't do medical speak. My biohazard disinfectant team is late, again. You just can't get good help. And they're unionized, so just try to complain. Did you ever think about cleaning the cage yourself? I don't even think you have a biohazard disinfectant team. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. But I guess I could try to clean things up around here. I'm not afraid of a little dirt. Melman, <laughs> press your attack button to spin that garbage out of your cage. Unless you like those germs. I don't do jerks. with wings and beaks, beaks! Get away from me! At last, the cleaning crew. See, Marty? See, see, see? Yep, I'll never doubt you again, Melman. Don't quote me on that, though. I'm more concerned with how the chaos affected my immune system. I'm sure it will recover. It's your mental state that you should be more worried about. The zoo is driving us crazy. I just have to get out to the wild. Thanks, Melman. Time to get back to my place and eat some of that fine Kentucky bluegrass for lunch. And dinner. And dessert. Come to visit us. Do come in and take a look at our many one-of-a-kind sale items. 